goodness, I think there are lots of keys to church growth. I'm not sure there is a one individual uh, church uh, growth principle. I think I was amazingly blessed to be present in both uh, Luton and in uh, um, Gerard's Cross, where these two churches are, uh, at a time when the churches were primed for growth. There was a sense in which uh, uh, my predecessors had, had done excellent foundational work and I simply built on that. In, in terms of what I think grows a church, I, I'd say that uh, um, there are excellence in Bible teaching and a commitment to scripture, uh, a thoroughgoing practical openness to the person and work of the Holy Spirit, uh, an ability to have dynamic leadership so you can cut through lots of things in church life which slow everything down. Um, and so issues around leadership, around biblical faithfulness, about spiritual openness, um, I think are essential. I suppose in the end, the key to delivering all that um, is the leadership piece, because if, if there aren't dynamic, spiritually open, uh, Christ-centered leaders, the church is always slowed down. One might say it never gets past the level of its leadership. So if the leadership is selfish or immature or in some way carnal, um, the church is bound to remain in that. So I think in the end, the key to church growth resides around the quality of leadership.